in downtown Richmond on East Gray Street. Two brothers from Cuba are living the American dream. I think that when you have love, then everything is possible. There's no shortage of love flowing from the kitchen at Kentico Cuban Bar and Grill, the destination guide's best Cuban restaurant in Richmond. Oh, I love it. I'm actually an island native, so it's from, a, from the island of Grenada. So a lot of the culture, I love it, love the food. Kentico is Kenny and Tico Sanchez, brothers who escaped Cuba in 1993. Tico, about six months after his older brother. Both were eventually taken in as foster children by the Leeming family of Richmond. This guy over here was my father for three years. He, he guided us, he telling the good and the bad, what we can do in this country to be successful, and here we are. You make me cry, I wish you would. The Sanchez brothers worked in construction before opening a food cart. They eventually grew their cart business to six before following Kenny's dream of opening a restaurant. They're artists, they're craftsmen, they, uh, they put their heart and soul not only in the menu and the place, but in creating an atmosphere, a family atmosphere. So it's, it's really been great. And that's Ken Tico. So we got many secrets of the Cuban recipe here that nobody had. That's why the food's so good. Tonight I had the mango wings along with the, the yellow plantains and, and the green plantains. To make a Havana chicken wing, we use the mango sauce. Mango sauce also have red onions, cilantro, orange bitter, uh, lemon juice, and a little spark of wine. The mango, right on top. When you eat it, you feel like you are, it's very tropical taste. With mango and cilantro. Unbelievable. Kentico's menu is a combination of reasonably priced sandwiches. Best Cuban sandwich north of Miami. And entrees. The beef steak palomilla. It's got beef and it's uh, mashed potatoes all around it and deep fried. I pretty much like anything with the Cuban pork in it, the way they marinate it and the seasonings. It's just something I've grown up with, so it's very much a childhood favorite of mine. And the next morning we put it in the oven. We start at 500 degrees, six and a half hours with uh, 350 degrees. At the time, this, this baby is going to be ready to eat. In the short time it's been open, Cantico has become the go-to restaurant for Caribbean natives. This is my house, Kentico and mi casa. I've been here for 14 years, let's get this straight, 14 years. And I never met so many Cubans from Puerto Rico until I opened this place. But it's also become a favorite of locals. Native Richmonder, this is something that's a little different. Uh, brings some diversity to downtown, so once I found it, fell in love with it. What's not to like about traditional Cuban food? Washed down with a menu full of mojitos. We're going to do one full lime so you get the full effect of the mojito when it comes in. We use the best here. We just got this all today from the farmer's market, fresh in Richmond. You're going to do about 2.4 ounces of that. It's really just three different ingredients. Then you use your rum, Bacardi Superior, best way to go. 1.5 ounces of that. Throw some ice on top and a lime. And that's all you have to do. That's a Cuban mojito. And like I said, this is my signature, so it's my favorite. So God bless. The food, the the the, well, the plantains are absolutely phenomenal. Uh, the mojitos, excellent. Um, uh, and the and the pulled pork can't go wrong. Cantico uh, is a, a dream come true for my husband for many many years. I'm real proud of them for. My wife and I and all the whole family is proud of what they've done. We work on everybody like you could be in my own house. Welcome to the front doors and we receive everybody with very humble, very respectful way and very dedicated.